prove that the matrices two matrices are given here 2 minus 5 minus 1 3 and 3 5 1 2 are inverse of each other we have to show that this two are inverse each other it means the product of this two is equal to identity matrix then they are inverse each other let's start let a is equal to this matrix 2 minus 5 minus 1 3 and b is equal to 3 5 1 2 so let's write on to show that a and b are inverse of each other to show that inverse of each other what we have to show or we have to show a b is equal to b a is equal to i where i is an identity matrix where i is an identity matrix of order 2 order 2 okay so now we have to find out the product of a b matrix a is equal to what is here we let here 2 minus 5 minus 1 3 and the matrix b we let here 3 5 1 2 let's find out the product of a b and then we have to find out the product of b a and we have to check either they are equal with identity matrix or not identity matrix means 1 0 0 1 now let's multiply this one i'm going to find multiply directly rows into column 2 into 3 6 minus 5 into 1 minus 5 now row into second column 2 into 5 10 minus 5 into 2 minus 10 again second row first column minus 1 into 3 minus 3 plus 3 into 1 3 again second row second column minus 1 into 5 minus 5 3 into 2 plus 6 now when you solve this what we get here 6 minus 5 1 10 minus 10 0 0 1 now look at here this is identity matrix but we have to check ba they are inverse each other or not to show that we have to find out a b also we have to find out ba also now matrix b is equal to what this one 3 5 1 2 and matrix a will it 2 minus 5 minus 1 3 let's multiply this two and check either they are inverse each other or not okay first row first column 3 into 2 6 plus 5 into minus 1 minus 5 we can write okay first row second column 3 into minus 5 minus 15 plus 5 into 3 15 second row first column 1 into 2 2 uh, 2 into minus 1 uh, minus 2 now second row second column 1 into minus 5 minus 5 plus 2 into 3 6 now when you find out the answer what we'll get here when you solve this 6 minus 5 we get 1 here we get 0 2 minus 2 0 and here when you solve 6 minus 5 1 now you can see here again we get here 1 0 0 1 so what we can write here therefore a b is equal to b a is equal to i and at last we have to write down so a and b are inverse of each other hope you understand this question number two